This girl is the real She-Hulk of TikTok. Just look at her body. She is completely ripped. She went viral on social media for her monumental body and her fans are obsessed with her delicate face. That woman is f***ing perfect, so beautiful and powerful. But not everyone is fond of her. Because while most girls focus their training only on the legs, she targeted her whole body. And she trained so hard that from her biceps and triceps to her shoulders and back, she looks like a male bodybuilder and this is not something easily achieved. You see, due to the levels of testosterone, women have fewer chances to grow the same size muscles and the same strength as men. This is why she became an inspiration when she claimed to be all natty. The best part about Melinda is that she's got such a cute girly face and her are hers, not silicone. Talk about a natural beauty, there is nothing fake on her. But not everyone is a fan, and definitely not everyone believes she's a natural. And because of that, a lot of people started accusing her of being a 100% juicy. This is Melinda Lindmark, a female bodybuilder from Sweden who took the internet by storm for her extraordinary muscles. Take a closer look, the definition and volume of her body are just insane. So much so that people say she has the face of a doll and the body of He-Man. And believe it or not, this didn't stop them from asking her to open and only f And guess what? She did. And she was just thriving when suddenly she started getting a lot of hate comments. Because turns out some people on Reddit accused her of not being natural and said she was using steroids to get that ripped. There is one simple rule to apply when trying to figure out if a woman is on steroids. Remove the head from the equation. If you spend more than one second trying to figure out, looking at the body, if it's male or female, then the answer is the good old Capri Sun, my friend. That's why people started doubting her, because her muscles are just too big. But she claims to be all natural, and that she even has something to prove it. She has a transformation video where you can see she didn't grow her muscles in just a couple of months, it is indeed the result of hard work over the years. Because back in 2015 she looked like this, then in 2019 she looked like this, and now she looks like this. So you can tell she's telling the truth when she says this didn't happen in just a couple of months. But is that enough to confirm that she isn't really using something to help her gain muscle mass? What do you think? Is she juicy or not?